not getting enough sleep at night. I've got great news for you. It could be doing more damage than just making you tired. Hey everyone, I'm Lacey Green and this is D News. I know many people already feel a little paranoid when they haven't gotten enough sleep, but just in case you needed more reasons to worry, scientists asked 30 people in their 20s to monitor their sleep for a few weeks and they found that not getting enough sleep may actually have a big effect on your genes. When the patients were sleep deprived, which meant around five hours of sleep, the number of genes that normally peak and wane throughout the day were greatly reduced. The activity of around 400 genes just straight up stopped, while another 300 genes were suppressed, which is not not good because the expression of these genes are linked to awesome things like fighting disease and managing stress and making sure you don't get sick. We already know that sleep deprivation can contribute to obesity, high blood pressure, memory loss, and even a shortened lifespan. Sleep deprivation could kill you, kind of. Those who sleep less than five hours a night have a 15% greater risk of death from all causes when compared to those in their age group who get a full eight hours. Other benefits of a full night's sleep include improved physical and creative performance, improved attention span, and it helps you avoid those sluggish zombie days at work. While we do have lots of information on sleep, newly emerging research on the link between sleep and genes will help us understand what molecular mechanisms are behind all those terrible or amazing things that happen when we do or don't sleep. Plus, it prompts some legit reflection on the crazy world we live in. I mean, maybe it's just me, but I feel like life just becomes less sleep friendly when you get older. And I know I'm not alone. A third of American adults don't get more than six hours on a regular basis either. Ideally, we should all be getting around seven to nine hours to do our best. So guys, how many hours of sleep are you getting at night? Do you think you get enough? Let me know what you think and maybe we could start our own little, you know, sleep deprivation club. Thanks for joining me for D News. I'll see you again soon.